Hola, welcome to Cash and Spanglish. This is Sai from very sunny Puerto Rico. How are you doing today? I hope you're having an amazing day. So today is Savings Challenge Tuesday. This is the day where I stuff my savings challenges. Now, if you know me, then you must know that I love savings challenges. I love making saving a little fun because sometimes saving just is not fun at all, right? When we have to save for things like traffic tickets, which I had to pay one um, last week, $70. But it's okay. Sometimes it's not cool and not fun when we're saving for those for those things. But when we're doing savings challenges, um, it's a little more fun, right? But before I get started with my savings challenges, I want to show you something that I am so excited about. You guys know I love Christmas. Christmas is my favorite time of the year. And I'll have available in my Etsy shop very soon my 12 days of Christmas savings challenge scratch off. So you'll save $78 with this challenge. You can save more if you want. I mean, you can add really whatever you want. So if you want to double the amount under each circle, um, it's up to you. And so, of course, one of these circles will, will have under it one of the 12 days of Christmas, and that will determine how much you're going to add to your envelope. This is printed on very heavy 130-pound cardstock, so it's a lot heavier than the usual cardstock that I use. And I just love this so much. It'll be available in my Etsy shop very, very soon, but if you want to make sure you get one before I put it on my Etsy shop send me a message over on Instagram and you can Venmo the amount to me or you can cash app it and I will mail one to you now these I'm not I'm going to do free shipping for these because I'm just going to use just regular old envelopes um, and put them in there and send them so that'll be less expensive for you and for me as well and also the size is five by seven so they're pretty big but you guys do know that giving is my love language, so I wasn't about to show you a new savings challenge without actually giving you the chance to win one. So I am giving one of these away. So all you have to do to win one of these is leave me a comment below and leave hashtag Christmas. So hashtag Christmas, I will choose a winner randomly by next week um, and send you this challenge so that you can have it as well. And so having said all that, let's get started with my savings challenges. Now, as you guys know, my very first envelope, of course, is Christmas. Don't we all just love, well, at least I do, I love Christmas. I'm adding $20 into Christmas this week. There is nothing, well, there's $5 in there because I've already purchased a whole bunch of presents. Um, and so this the cash money has been depleted next thing i'll be dipping into is my uh my rewards now let me just say i've already purchased all of these presents but i am going to get some of this money back because my husband gives me half of everything that i spent on presents so except whatever presents he buys for me and whatever i buy for him of course every other present we pay for half and half because every present we give to our family is from the both of us right so i've already what i like to do is i just buy all the presents and then i tell him you owe me this much and then he pays me and then we call it a day and i put it back into my envelope so whenever we do that whenever i'm done buying presents um i'll tell him how much it is and i'll put the money back in here and let me find my Christmas tracker. As you guys know, I use this notebook as a tracker. Um, and I have three funding sources for my Christmas savings challenge. So in cash, I just added $20. I have $1.55 in my coins. And $5.49 and were added to my... $5.49 were added to my rewards this week which is awesome so in total oh, so in total let me grab my calculator hold on i still actually had space at the bottom of this page so i have 445 is what i saved in cash in coins 122.55 plus I said I had a dollar 55 in coins and 
that is why did i write this here goodness 124.10 so 124 dollars and 10 cents so and then i have 362 dollars and 34 cents in my rewards it'll be on the screen here somewhere the screenshot so in total i have saved 445 dollars plus 124.10 plus 362 34 $931.44 is the total that I have saved for Christmas so far and that just makes me extremely happy so let me grab my coins and my coin jar and let's stuff that so we can be done with Christmas Okay, so we have $124.10 and my goal this year for my coins is $130. So I am very close to that. All right, so what we added this week for Christmas was $20 cash, 155 coins, 549 in rewards, and that is a total of $27.04 that we added to my Christmas funds for this week. And I love that, that is awesome. So next, I'm moving on to Rabito Contento and they are a nonprofit organization. Let me grab my trackers. That rescues stray dogs and cats off the streets of Puerto Rico. And I just, I do this challenge so I can donate money to them um, at least once a month. So I have these doggy playing cards. I just, oh, I can't even shuffle them anymore because there aren't that many left. I just pick one randomly and the card will tell me how much I'm going to add to the envelope this week. So I'm grabbing this one. And this is four of spades. Did someone say food? That is cute. Dogs are such foodies, right? Like I've never met a dog that didn't love eating. So I'm adding $4, one, two, three, four, to this envelope. and whatever is in there we'll donate at the end of the month let me fill in my tracker okay so now let me write the amount here so last week i added 15 dollars, and this week i added four so so far we're doing pretty well 19 dollars for this month so before I move on to my other challenges, I'm going to stuff my 100 envelope box. Now the next envelope we have here is 20. All right, so that is stuffed. And guys, I have never, not once, been able to complete the 100 envelope challenge. And that is okay. Sometimes I just need the money from there and I'll take it if it's absolutely necessary, right? Um, so if, if that has happened to you as well, no worries. It's okay. Don't be too hard on yourself. So next I'm going to be doing my um, support small challenge. And with this challenge, I just buy um, savings challenges off of Etsy shops and do them on my channel. Hopefully give um, these creators a little bit of exposure, right? So um, the creator of this is creations by sam it'll be on the screen and also links below and let me find a coin so that i can scratch one of these off so i have my coin and i'm going to scratch the very top one okay i got a five i think i should do another one let's try this one And I got a 10. That's 15. Should I do one more? What if I get a 20? Hmm. Let's just do one more. It'll be okay. Okay, so I got a 10 this time. So in total, I have to add $25 to my support small envelope and guys i'm just about ready to count how much we have in this envelope i'm so excited to see how much i have um but maybe i'll wait till the end of the month 
so next i have my wordle challenge now i've already explained what wordle is but it's basically a word game and um if you don't know what it is go ahead google it it's by the new york times it's very fun for us people that like word games um and today's wordle i'm recording this on monday so today's wordle was graph so that is one g it's one dollar then it's the letter r which is three dollars that's four a is five dollars i mean a is one dollar that's five dollars in total and then the p is next which is where's the p right here so that's one dollar that's six dollars and then h is two dollars so that's eight dollars right am i right yeah eight dollars in total so that is what i'm adding into my wordle envelope i'll try to next time try to figure out how much it is before i start recording so i don't have to go through that whole entire mess so eight dollars in my wordle savings challenge so i'm going to do my monthly savings challenge these mini savings challenges are available in my etsy shop and i keep bumping into the sunflower and i'm doing three dollars for each pumpkin so this week i'm adding i think six dollars all right so that is colored in and next is finally my challenge book so this challenge book i won in a giveaway my friend sanya's channel it is called the ultimate money saving challenge book and the page that i am currently doing is feed the gumball machine savings challenge let's see how many do i have left one two three four five six seven so each one of these um gets three dollars seven by three is 21 i think i'll just finish it okay so i need to add 21 dollars into this challenge and this challenge is completed so let's count how much we have in this envelope okay so i have 10 20 30 35 40 45 50 55 60 61 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 oops 71 2 3 4 5 so 75 dollars in my challenge book envelope this money is going into my savings <coughs> allergies now let's fill in the date that i finished this i started on august 31st and today is october what is it 16th so october 16th 2023 and that is just about a month and a half that i that it took me to finish this challenge so next week i'm going to start with oh goodness it's a christmas it's a christmas tree yay 75 dollars mini holiday fund savings challenge with bonus oh yeah we love the christmas tree so that i'll be starting next week So next, I am doing the Domino's Savings Challenge. Now, these savings challenges have been getting a lot of love in my Etsy shop. Thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. And this is a bundle of 10 different savings challenges. And most of them are just like really small amounts because that is what I can afford. So I like to sell things that I can also enjoy myself, right? So how much am I doing this week? Should I just go in order here? So this one is 11. Okay. So I'm going to add 11. And should I do the bonus round? Okay. Let's see. How much should I do? 
I have a few ones, a few fives. I think I'm just going to do 10 more dollars. How's that? So I'm going to fill this one out. Okay, so that is my Domino Savings Challenge. And next is my Frenchie Kisses. And this is also from that Savings Challenge bundle. And, oh goodness, I just love this one so much. You guys know that I love dogs. So each kiss is $10 and then each paw is 5 So I think I'm going to do 10 15 I'll do $20. Hmm. Let's see. 10, 20, 25, 30. I'll do $30. So, two, because I have um, money left. Now, anything that I do have left over, I'll just roll, roll it over to next week. So, um, it's okay with, I'm okay with that. So, I did $30, which is two kisses and then two paws. Okay, so I'm done with my Frenchie Kisses Savings Challenge. I love this so much. I can't say it enough. And finally, I'm going to do my rollover ones. Let me grab that binder. Okay, so this is my book binder, and this is where I stuff my rollover ones that I have during the week for my spending money. So this week I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine dollars in rollover. That is awesome. Now let me put these in order. Okay, so these are in order now. And starting off, I got one A. I have one B. By the way, I did a bill exchange um, in this binder and it's in a short video. So I have no C's this week and then I have one D. I have one E. And then I have a couple of F's, so two F bucks. I have one, two G bucks. And then no H's or I's this week, but I do have one J and that is it for my rollover ones. And also that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for being here. I truly appreciate every single one of you. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, I hope you consider doing so. If you enjoyed this video, also leave me a thumbs up and leave me a comment below. And don't forget to write hashtag Christmas if you want to a chance to win that scratch off giveaway. Once again, thank you. And I hope you have the most amazing and blessed day. Bye bye.